Hey everyone, welcome back to another amazing video. Today we're checking out some incredible new UI design tools which will allow you to create some amazing designs for free. So without further ado, let's just get started with this tutorial. Before we get started, make sure you're following me on Instagram for weekly cool updates and live sessions. So the first incredible tool is called relate.app and Relate allows you to create UI designs inside your browser and lets you convert those designs directly into code. Once you have logged in, it will allow you to select out of three templates or will allow you to start from scratch. I'm just gonna click on starter and let's see what happens. They've already prepared a website for you. The interface looks very similar to what you will find in XD or Figma with all these components and layers on the left. Selecting any one component will allow you to change everything here. You can see code live being edited. If you click on this code button on the top left, you will get the entire code on this page. And the special part is if you find any code online or if you're into coding as well, you can just type in some commands in JS, whatever you like, and that will get updated on this page. I can even set animations in this tool. So if I click on this text right here, there will be an option called states on the right. If I click on this and click on hover, it'll allow me to make changes and that will happen on hover. I might change the font size from 56 to something like 72, which is much bigger. So if I click on this play button on the top left, and if I hover over this text, see how this animates. Of course, the animation is not very smooth. It is just for reference. If you thought Figma and XD are powerful applications, well, you should try Gravit Designer. It's a complete design tool. It allows you to design user interfaces like this, as well as allows you to edit and create vectors and photo editing like this. Now, the best part is you can either download the app onto your computer or you can try this out on the web itself. So you don't have to download anything at all. It has multiple templates, so you can even design stuff like t-shirts if you want. But in this case, we might just select something like the iPhone 7 or the iPhone 8 and this will create an artboard much like in XD and Figma. You have similar tools as well as similar shortcuts. So if I want to create a basic rectangle, I can just click on R and that will allow me to create a basic rectangle. Very simple to use, very similar to all the other design tools out there. A lot of cool image editing features inside the application as well. So you can try out a lot of things like curved shadows. As you can see, there's a curve in the shadow. So it seems as if it's, these are some features not even Figma and XD have right now. So I think this is one of those tools which is a complete powerhouse. Now, Facebook is launching its very own design tool that they use for their applications. It's called Origami 3 Beta. Origami is an application which existed already, but this is their new and improved Origami. And the cool part is they've recently introduced a feature very similar to Auto Animate or Smart Animate in Figma and XD. They have a lot of cool features like haptic feedback, so you can even tap into your phone's vibration motors. You can even allow your phone to access your GPS and you, you are able to create such 3D images with device motion. How cool is that? Now inside this, you can see everything happening live. So any changes you make, you'll be able to see the prototype immediately. All these interactions are guided by this interaction tab at the bottom. And if I double click here, I get a lot of these animations that I can I can then create and adjust on my own. For example, there's animation like pop animation. I can just place the patch and I just need to attach the artboard one to this pop animation rather than this interaction right here. Now, this is a fun tool for Windows users. So Windows users rejoice. This is called Lunacy 6. And consider Lunacy 6 like a sketch for Windows, which is impossible, but for now it has been made possible. They have a lot of inbuilt tools like icons, photos, masked photos. So you can create a lot of these masked layouts without having to trace the photos out. And of course, vector illustrations all built into one single powerful tool. And as you can see, you can 
there's full support for sketch sketch files for editing symbols and overrides very similar to sketch libraries so all the sketch libraries you can get into this file and a bunch of other cool features like cloud sharing and hosting component libraries exporting to code as well as dark mode so if you are on windows and you're not using this tool i guess you're missing out on a lot of these features now this next tool is called editor x and this is a tool by the wix team so if you've used wix this will be easy to use this tool is a lot like webflow but it is much easier to understand for designers like you and i and also allows you to export code at the end of the projects. So you're not only restricted to their editor, but also can export code for other editors. Once you reach here, all you need to do is just pick and drop components that you like. You can add a custom element. They have all these elements prepared already for you. Things like titles, paragraphs, containers, HTML iframes, so you can so you basically can embed stuff like videos and other cool stuff as well as you have a lot of custom containers like cards and a lot of layouts pre-made for you. If at any point of time you are stuck or you don't know how to do something on the page, you can always switch. You can always switch to their Academy X, which is a simple site which allows you to learn how to use Editor X to create amazing looking websites for free once again. I hope you liked today's video. If you did, make sure to subscribe to the channel. It really helps me out. And I post every Monday and Thursday. So I'll see you next time in the same place, same time. God bless.